Hey guys, what's happening? So it's just about midnight right now and I work in the morning so I don't really know why I'm doing this but I'm doing it. So I'm making a video tonight just so I can um, have a video ready. If you hear that super obnoxious sound, it's my fan and I'm turning it off now. <laughs> so if I actually die of heat stroke during this video, that's why. Anyways, so I'm really tired and I actually haven't had a very good day today so I decided that I'd make a video and hopefully my day or my night would at least end on a good note. So that's what I'm going to do today. Um, if you're not already subscribed to my channel, feel free to do so. I'm a pretty cool person and I make videos on occasion. <laughs> I'd like to make them more often but I'm having some personal issues right now. so. That's why, but I will try to get more on track with it. And yeah, so I'm going to do a video on 32 random questions. I brought up 32 random questions and I'm going to answer the questions to the best of my ability. And I have not pre-read these questions, so I have no idea what they're asking. So this will be... It's already hot. I hate myself. Oh, also follow me on my social media. I have an Instagram, a Twitter, and Facebook if you're interested. I have them down below. And yeah, so let's do it. So first question. Do you sleep with your closet doors open or closed? Closed. Why would I purposely open my closet doors <laughs> before I go to sleep? Just go to my closet. Ooh, gotta open them. No. Mm -mm. Absolutely not. I don't need anything peeking at me. Because with me, why am I holding that? With me, I have a problem. Literally, my brain makes me like see things that aren't there. It's like the craziest thing. I'll be thinking about something scary and then I'll start seeing it and imagining it and I can't. Doors are closed. <laughs> Do you take shampoo and conditioner from hotels? Um, like the little bottles. I rarely go to hotels because I don't go anywhere ever. Um, but when I do go to hotels, uh, there normally isn't any left for me to take because I use it all, but if there is, I will take it, yes. Do you sleep with your sheets tucked in or out? <laughs> Literally, you guys, people think I'm so weird for this. I don't even use my comforter as a blanket. Like, I literally sleep on top of my comforter and I use a different blanket. <laughs> so my sheets are definitely tucked in. It's because it saves me from having to make my bed every morning. That's so annoying. So I just sleep on top of the comforter and call it a day, so. Have you ever stolen a street sign? That is a very random question. No, I've never stolen anything. Well, actually I did one time, but it was an accident and I returned it. No, not one of the things that I have done. Do you cut out coupons and then never use them? I receive a crap ton of coupons and never use them. And I cut them out of like magazines, like Ulta magazines or whatever. I'm like, oh my gosh, I'm totally going to use this. Like I get coupons for like buying something. So I'll go to Walgreens or Albertsons or whatever. And they'll print me out like a crap ton of coupons that I can actually use. And I never use them. I do not know why. And I repeatedly buy the same thing that I have the coupon for. But I never use the freaking coupon. Like, ugh, I'm so annoying. This was just a reminder. I need to use my coupons. But I'll forget again and I won't use them. And they'll expire. You know... That one's hard because I really would rather not be attacked by anything at all, um, but if I had to choose, I'm gonna say bear. No, we don't have bears where I live, so I, that's really not, there's not even a chance that would happen to me here. I don't know, you guys. Maybe bees? It would hurt really bad, but I think I might survive. A bear, probably not. It's like 15 times my size. That's exaggerated, but I'm just saying, like... I don't know, I feel like I'd have a better survival rate with bees than a bear. Do you always smile for pictures? I never smile for pictures. This is something my coworkers have brought up to me and I, I just don't. I do not like the way I look when I smile in a picture because I've got this tooth, okay? Well, first of all, I don't have the whitest teeth in the world and that's so aggravating because I want my teeth to be white but they're not and I, I, I'm poor. Um, also, I had braces, but my teeth aren't that straight anymore because my retainer's broken. I still wear it, but it's broken. And then also I have this tooth right here. 
that is darker than the rest of them because um, I believe some of the nerves in my tooth are dead. So now it is darker than the rest and it makes me look like I have no tooth in pictures and it just makes me uncomfortable with myself. Do you ever count your steps when you walk? No, but what I do sometimes is when I'm walking on like a sidewalk, I'll make sure that I don't step on the lines. Like I'll, I literally walk like an idiot. Like make sure that I do like two or three steps in each like individual square and miss not step on the line. So I will literally like be walking and I'll have to stop and step over the line. I don't know, like I'm weird, I'm weird. I'm like, I'm not afraid to break my mom's back, but I don't know what it is. I really don't, so. Have you ever peed in the woods? Yes, I have, and it was a pleasant experience. No, actually it was not. I peed on my pants, so. And it was like in the middle of the night and I had to pee really bad and I was in like pajama pants and I squatted down and I totally missed the ground and peed all over my pants and that was disgusting and everyone was asleep. Do you still watch cartoons? Yes, I literally sleep with cat dog on every single night. Like Rugrats and cat dog are always on when I go to sleep. My favorite is Spongebob, don't play with me, that's my show. Um, yes, I watch cartoons on, the daily, on a daily basis. Where would you bury hidden treasure if you had some? I wouldn't bury my treasure. I would either sell my treasure or keep my treasure, but I wouldn't bury it. I don't get why you would want to bury your treasure, like for what? I do not understand the concept. Like. What do you drink with dinner? Water. I drink water with everything. I literally don't drink anything else. What do you dip a chicken nugget in? Eat, uh, mostly barbecue sauce. That's kind of like my preference when it comes to nuggets. When it comes to tenders, like chicken tenders, ranch. What movies could you watch over and over and still love? Uh, I don't know. I watch a lot of movies over and over. You know what? I have one. And a lot of you probably have zero idea what this movie is and all of you guys are probably going to be thinking like what the fudge with the movie title but it's an old Nickelodeon movie and they're all it's like a British well they're all British it, it's like based over there it's called Angus Thongs and Perfect Snogging Nickelodeon movie and it's so funny to me and I freaking love that movie and I've watched it so many times and it's never gotten old so were you ever a Girl Scout? Yes, I was. I was a lot of things. I did karate, I did ballet. Ballet? What? Ballet, and I was a Girl Scout. My mom always made me do some random crap. Um, I hated it. I absolutely hated it. I don't recommend. <laughs> would you ever strip or pose nude in a magazine? I can't say that I would, actually. Um, I'd rather not expose my goods to everyone on the planet. Like, I kind of want to save that for like a special person, not like here. Everyone witness me. No, I'll pass actually. Um, can you change the oil in your car? Absolutely not. I know nothing about my car except how to put gas in it and you know, drive it. Have you ever gotten a speeding ticket? No, but I have gotten pulled over twice. One time for speeding. I was like going 79 on a 65. He let me go. And the second time I got pulled over for being in the HOV lane, um, with just one person and also for speeding and I did get a ticket. Am I afraid of heights? Yes and no. It kind of depends on the circumstance that I'm in. Like I was a cheerleader and I was a flyer and they are held up pretty high and that never scared me but like if I was on a really tall building on the ledge like I would die instantly. Do you sing in the car? Absolutely. I literally have a concert in my car. Like I cannot imagine driving in my car without singing. It's just the way to go. You know, you can't play a good song and not sing to it. Like how, how do people do that? Like how do you just sit in your car and silently listen to the song? Like, no, I have to sing along. What are you doing? Is Christmas stressful? The actual holiday itself is not stressful whatsoever. I mean, it's Jesus's birthday. Like, no, it's not. But buying gifts is, especially when you are a poor person. Um, that's why you go the cheap route. You let them know in advance, hey, I'm poor, you're not gonna get that great of a gift because I'm poor. But, it's the thought that counts. And that's it, and call it a day. Occupations you wanted to be when you were a kid. Oh my gosh, 
I wanted to be a singer, I wanted to be a teacher, I wanted to be a marine biologist. I've always wanted to be an actress. Um, what else did I want to do? I wanted to be so many things, it's unreal. I always, I really, really wanted to be a teacher. I always played school. I was constantly pretending that I had a classroom and I had a whiteboard and everything and like I would print out worksheets, like a bunch of them, like I had students wasting paper constantly. I was always doing that. Do you believe in ghosts? Yeah, I do. I do. Yeah. I don't understand why there's ghosts or like what they are really because I'm a Christian so I believe like when you die you either go to heaven or you go to hell so I don't really know what they are like what a ghost is but I do believe in them somehow um the first concert you ever went to the first concert I ever went to I think I may have told you this in my very first video ow it was actually a Hannah Montana concert um it was really good actually I really enjoyed it I would watch it again but you know, she doesn't do those concerts anymore, so whatever. Walmart, Target, or Kmart? Okay, Kmart, not even. Ooh, Walmart, Target. Depending on what I'm going there for, for like room decor, Target 100%, or just like to go walk around and have fun, Target, absolutely. But for like food and like more essentials, like makeup and all that stuff, Walmart. I will go to Walmart over Target. Nike or Adidas, I obviously have to pick Nike because I work there. Um, and I also just like the quality of the brand better. If you're more into actually athletic clothing, like clothing to actually work out in or run in, you need to get Nikes because they are specifically made for those things. And obviously their sportswear section, like lifestyle section is obviously really awesome too. But like for actual athletic wear, that is the way to go. Adidas is more like just lifestyle clothing, not really something you're going to want to work out in. So I will definitely choose Nike over Adidas any day. I don't own any Adidas actually, so. Can you curl your tongue? How? Like, uh, like that or like? Have you ever cried because you were so happy? I can't say that I have, actually. No, mm -mm. I only cry when I'm upset or when I'm really angry or frustrated. Like any of like the negative emotions, that's when I cry. I don't think I've ever cried because I've been happy. Well, maybe like when I'm in church and I'm like singing, I'll start crying. Can you swim well? Um, me, kind of, yeah. I can, I mean, I can swim, I can do more than a doggy paddle, but I'm not, I'm no freaking Olympic swimmer or anything like that. Never been on a swim team, but I, I can swim, I guess. But like, if I was being, if I was in an ocean and like there was waves and crap, there's no way I would survive just on swimming. Absolutely not. No, my legs get too tired and my arms do too. Can you knit or crochet? Um, I cannot knit, but I do know how to crochet. Well, I did know. I really kind of forgot, but I, I actually crocheted a scarf. It was supposed to be a blanket, and then I got bored, and I made it a scarf, so. Are you a dog person or a cat person? It really depends on the day and my mood and the way that they're acting, because if one of them's being like an a-hole, then I really don't like them. Um, so yeah, that is all of the questions. I really hope that you guys enjoyed them and got some entertainment out of it. I wanted to do a little bit of a different video than I've been doing recently. I've been doing like all beauty and like fashion videos, and I kind of wanted to steer away from that for a minute and do something a little more random, I guess you could say. So. Uh, that's all. I really hope that you guys enjoyed it and stay tuned for next week because mm, maybe I'll post a video. <laughs> Probably. Okay. Yeah. Subscribe. Bye.